Allergic Reactions In this video, we will talk about allergic reactions and how to use an epinephrine pen. Allergies are quite common. A severe allergic reaction can quickly turn into a medical emergency. Some things that can cause a severe allergic reaction are eggs, peanuts, chocolate, some medications, insect bites and stings, especially bee stings. Mild versus severe allergic reaction. Allergic reactions can be mild or severe. However, some reactions that seem mild can become severe within minutes. Here are some signs of mild and severe allergic reactions. Mild allergic reaction. Stuffy nose, sneezing, and itching around the eyes. Itching of the skin. Raised red rash on the skin, hives. Severe allergic reaction. Trouble breathing. Swelling of the tongue and face. Signs of shock. Epinephrine pen for severe allergic reaction. Epinephrine is a drug that can stop a severe allergic reaction. It is available by prescription in a self-injectable pen device called an epinephrine pen. People who are known to have severe allergic reactions are encouraged to carry epinephrine pens with them at all times. There are two types of epinephrine pens, spring-activated and electronic. They are different for children and adults, so be sure you're using the correct prescribed device. If a person has an epinephrine pen, they will generally know how and when to use it. You may help give the person the injection if you have been trained and your stat and employer allow it. The epinephrine injection is given in the side of the thigh. How to use an epinephrine pen. A severe allergic reaction can be life-threatening. Follow these steps to help someone with signs of a severe allergic reaction use their epinephrine pen. Follow the instructions on the pen. Make sure you are holding the pen in your fist without touching either end because the needle comes out of one end. You may give the injection through clothes or on bare skin. Take off the safety cap. Hold the leg firmly in place just before and during the injection. Press the tip of the injector hard against the side of the person's thigh about halfway between the hip and the knee. For EpiPen Junior injectors, hold the injector in place for 3 seconds. Some other injectors may be held in place for up to 10 seconds. Be familiar with the manufacturer's instructions for the type of injector you are using. Pull the pen straight out, making sure you don't put your fingers over the end that has been pressed against the person's thigh. Either the person getting the injection or the person giving the injection should rub the injection spot for about 10 seconds. Note the time of the injection. Give the pen to the emergency responders for proper disposal. Call 911 if the person doesn't get better or if there is a delay greater than 10 minutes for advanced help to arrive. Consider giving a second dose if available. Dispose of the epinephrine pen correctly. It's important to dispose of needles correctly so that no one gets stuck. Follow the company's Sharps disposal policy. If you don't know what to do, give the needle to someone with more advanced training. If possible, save a sample of what caused the reaction.